Howdy. So if you've ever run PageSpeed Insights, which I've just done on WPShout.com here, you might notice uh, suggestions that you minify CSS, minify JavaScript. Um, and that's kind of hard to deal with on a WordPress site because you're running a bunch of plugins. So if I look at the recommendations for us, one of these is our themes style sheet, which we could reasonably minify, but another is coming from a plugin we use called Monarch and another one's from a plugin we use called WPG Form. And similarly, if I look at the uh, at the JavaScript, what I'm seeing is two, one from a plugin we wrote and one from Monarch again. So it's hard for me to minify that CSS and JavaScript because I didn't write at all. Um, and that's really common on WordPress sites, I would say. But there's a solution and it's called a plugin called Autoptimize. It's kind of a weird combination of words. It's auto and optimize together without the second P, uh, O in it. So if you search for auto optimize in your dashboard and you install it, you can then activate it once it's installed. And out of the box, all you'll notice that's different is that you get this, but don't take this as a sign that it's fully ready to go. You need to actually, but this little auto optimize thing up here isn't ready to go. You can actually click here or you can go under settings, auto optimize. And there you want to turn it on. You want to optimize HTML, JavaScript, and CSS. And if I actually look at the PageSpeed Insights, I think it probably, no, it actually wasn't complaining about my HTML, but nonetheless, I'm going to go ahead and use Auto Optimize on that as well. And so I'm going to take this opportunity. Remember, I got a 63 on mobile, a 81 on desktop. And if I reanalyze after installing and loading Auto Optimize, I now get a 72 on mobile and an 84 on desktop. It's not the hugest difference in the world, difference in the world, um, but it does make a meaningful difference to minify that CSS and JavaScript, and it's still considered best practice on 97.99% of web servers. Um, so definitely, auto optimize or a plugin like it. There are many, many plugins that'll do the same thing. Auto optimize just really strikes me as a very nice plugin, so it's the one I'm going to recommend to you. Hopefully, that's helpful to you.